Turkish state-owned company MKE, Mekin Kimya Industrisi, has completed sea trials of the indigenously developed 76mm naval gun on board Barak class, Desti N. Diorv's class of ISO, Corvette TCG Baykaz, F-503. Developed by Turkish MKE company, and three subcontractor companies, and Istanbul Naval Shipyard, the 76-62mm national naval gun has passed harbor and sea trials successfully. Yasin Akhtara, general manager of MKE Inc., announced the event on his Twitter account on August 19, 2022. On the orders of our president and with the support of our defense minister, we've manufactured the 76-62mm naval gun with indigenous resources and it successfully passed all live-firing tests. The trials were conducted aboard the Barak-class Corvette TCG Baykaz in the Saras Bay firing range, but the dates of the trials weren't disclosed by officials. After the production of the 7662 naval gun was completed in 12 months, the first land firing trials were conducted at the Konya slash Karapina firing range in November 2021. After completion of the land trials, the gun was fitted aboard TCG Baykaz at the Istanbul Naval Shipyard facilities in July 2022. About one month later, harbor and sea acceptance tests were completed. Now that the qualification tests have been completed, Nothing stands in the way of the decision to mass-produce the Italian OTO Malara equivalent naval gun. Numerous naval vessels of the Turkish Navy, Gavia-class frigates, Alfax, Milgem-class corvettes, etc., are armed with 76mm guns. The production of this gun domestically is therefore an important step for the Turkish defense industry. Turkai has procured 76mm guns from Leonardo for decades, and cooperation between the Italian OEM and MKE dates back at least to 2009 with an agreement for the Turkish company to produce 76mm gun barrels. The project was initiated in 2020 due to the high procurement costs and long delivery time for the 76mm guns. According to a statement made by MKE's managing director during an event sponsored by the Saha Istanbul Defense and Aerospace Cluster Association in 2021, Leonardo was asking 8.2 million euros for a 76mm gun. He also revealed that the Turkish 76mm gun costs far less, 4.7 million euros. The state-owned company MKE is the primary contractor for the project. Three private sector companies have been working on the project as subcontractors. In addition to costing the project half the price, MKE claims that it will extend the barrel's life with a special coating applied to the barrel of the gun. The company also stated that the indigenous 76mm naval gun stands out with its features such as the ability to fire a wider variety of ammunition compared to the Italian product, the ability to use special fuse bullets, and its electromechanical structure that allows digital control.